Well, we've done quite a few things to the CNC since the last little video we uh, posted, making some changes and things like that, and we'll go over that in another video. But what I want to show in this one here are the energy chains and how well they work. There's a pretty good design uh, Mike will come up with here. I'll, I'll run these and get an idea how they work. You notice that uh, all, the, uh, all the cables are nicely managed. You can move back and forth. They're not hanging from the ceiling anymore. Makes it pretty nice. And of course, the x-axis uh, is uh, done there as well. So um, the router uh, power cord still hanging out. We got the PID to do. I think in the, in, for the interim, I'll run extension cord or something until I hook up the PID, and we'll run through this other other uh, chain. If you notice this uh, this works quite well. I'm really pleased with it. I'll uh, have to pay attention here to what I'm doing so I don't uh, crash into anything instead of jabbering. So that's uh, that's the heat change. Uh, I thought about taking them off, painting them black, and when I mentioned it, Zach, who's uh, kind enough to run the camera right now, looked at me like I had three eyeballs, one in the center of my head. But no, we weren't taking them off. We're just going to leave one there and leave that nice, pretty brown. So, anyway, that's the heat change, and thanks for watching.